people always wonder what's going on with the Smooth One or Smooth One Productions. Basically, um, I did the relationship type thing. I dated a lot of different women. You know, as time went by, I had kids. I have beautiful children. But now, in this stage of my life, uh, I'm not one to deal with companionship. I enjoy the work. I enjoy using the camera. I enjoy using home studio equipment. And I deal with people in public. I don't have that much company. When you see me, you see me. I don't smoke. I don't drink. Because alcohol took a, took out a lot of people in my family, a lot of females in my family. But no here, no there. You do what you got to do. So I'm not one that condones smoking and drinking. If you do what you do, it has nothing to do with me. I don't hang around it. I respect that's what you do for fun. That's what you do for activities. That's on you. But when you're around me, I don't want you smoking in my face because after a while, I just walk away. But if you want to talk about sports, photography, videography, uh, politics, uh, the viruses and, you know, the issues dealing with people taking the vaccine and stuff like that and people that don't want to take the vaccine for religious reasons and health reasons, you must respect that. Everybody can't take the vaccine. And sometimes a lot of people was having bad side effects because everybody's body is not adapted to whatever's in the vaccine. These, this times is test. They're putting all these things together and telling you to take it and they ain't testing it on themselves, but they want you to take it from all these companies. All these companies, are they in conjunction with the center of the D Center Disease Control Center or safety guidelines on what are the side effects of you taking this vaccine? What are the side effects? They don't tell you that. They just say, hey, take the Johnson & Johnson. Take the Pfizer. Take the this one. Take the that one. Oh, it's oh, you got to take one now and then you take one 6 months later and then you will have you don't have to take a shot. And then what happens 6 months later? Oh no, there's a different strain out and you're going to have to take another shot and another shot. And then now it's going to be like insulin. You're going to have to keep taking it every 6 months, every 12 months, year after year. Now you're going to be dependent on like insulin. Insulin, your life depends on it. Because who knows? I don't know. Is it a man-made virus? Did it actually, hold on, as they say, Japan, China, or whatever. Did it actually come from somebody eating a bat in a remote part of China or a remote part of Japan? and Or was it created in a laboratory somewhere? And they tried to say, oh, the laboratory was in China. And uh, the two of the workers, the workers got out of something. I don't know. Nobody knows. But now it's like they're trying to say, you take this, you, you either take this or you die. A lot of people didn't take it. And a lot of people are not dead. A lot of people that took it have side effects. Even, you're not guaranteed, even if you take it that you won't contract the COVID. So I don't know. It's a lot of questions out there that can't be answered. But right now, all this so-called vaccine is a test. It's like, remember when you got pneumonia? Remember when you got the flu vaccine? What is the flu vaccine? So that means the vaccine might be just something 
that came from someone that already had the virus and they overcome the virus and now their immune system is immune to the virus so it can't affect them as the way it affected them the first time is that a possibility i don't know but you have to honor everybody's opinion on how they feel about taking and not taking the vaccine Oh, you're stupid if you don't. Oh, you're stupid if you do. Everybody has their own opinion. Everybody has their own view. Everybody has their own reasons for taking it or not taking it. You have to respect that. They're not stupid. That's their opinion. That's how they feel. Their body is their temple. You think everybody feels comfortable with Johnson & Johnson shot? Do you think everybody's comfortable with Pfizer shot? They're saying, oh, you take it twice and you ain't got to worry about it no more. Now it's a Delta virus out. Where did the Delta virus come from? Is that another strain of COVID? Is that a mutated strain of COVID? Nobody knows. Oh, boy. Here we go. I'm out.